All right, so we've carried all of our colors up, and the next row is going to be gray and black. So you want to make sure that all your colors are sitting on the next row, if you're carrying. Now if you're cutting it at the end, that's fine and dandy too. You can start with your gray or whatever color you're starting with. So all I'm going to do is wrap all three around and pull through this chain. Give it a little tug to tighten it down. And the two colors that I'm going to carry or I'm going to work with is the gray and the black. So all I'm going to do is pull this gray and the black over like this. And I'm going to let this white hang out because we don't need that white. And our first color is going to be gray. So this is going to be a chain. It's going to be a little big chain, but it's okay. And we're going to chain one. And we're going to pull all these down. Chain two and chain three. Now our gray, our white is down there and it'll be ready to carry up when we get back here. And we're going to start our pattern. So it's this is the decrease row, so we did a chain three. And then it comes from, that goes with that one. So we're going to do a decrease in the next two. So a decrease is into the stitch, like that. Draw up, pull through, yarn over, and go through two. Yarn over, go into the next stitch, yarn over, pull through, yarn over, go through two, and then yarn over, go through all three. You just completed a decrease. So now in the last stitch, we're, we're going to put a start a double crochet, but we're not going to finish it because we're going to change colors. We're going to take the next color, we're going to pull through and finish that double crochet. And we're going to start the pattern again. One double crochet. Two double crochets, three double crochets, and you know in the fourth we're going to start a double crochet, pick up our other color, and finish this double crochet. And we're going to work that pattern all the way till you get to your stitch marker. And when we get to this, when I get to the stitch marker, the last two. You're going to put a double crochet in that and a double crochet in that and you will repeat that back down which would be your two whites here and a double crochet white and a double crochet white and finish the pattern coming all the way back and I will meet you at the decrease of our return pass. Alright, 